iron tires of horse carts. To fit an iron rim tightly on the wheel, it is made with diameter slightly smaller than that of the wheel. It is heated and made to slide over the wheel and then left to cool. It contracts and fits very tightly. Railway Tracks If provisioning is not made for allowing expansion in summer and contraction in winter, railway tracks can be damaged. To avoid this, they join taper dance overlapping. Telephone and Electric Lines These are kept sagging in summer. So that when they contract in winter, these do not break. Demonstration of Thermal Expansion in Solids Grave Sands Ball and Ring Experiment The apparatus consists of a metallic ring through which a metal ball can just pass at room temperature. When the ball is heated to a high temperature, then again placed on the ring, one finds that the ball does not pass through the ring. This shows that on heating, the diameter of the ball has increased. The sagging wire. The apparatus consists of a metal wire hung between two stands. Cut and ring is made to pass through the wire. When the wire is heated, we find that the ring begins to sag in the wire, indicating the increase in the length of the wire. Bimetallic strip A bimetallic strip is made from two thin strips of metal, which expand by different amounts when heated. Often brass and steel are selected. The two pieces are welded. When heated, Brass expands more than steel, bending the strip into an arc. Automatic Fire Alarm An automatic fire alarm in a building's security system is a heat detector that responds to the heat from a fire by setting off an alarm. Some heat-detecting fire alarms rely on a bimetallic strip as the temperature sensor. This strip responds to heat by closing a normally open electrical circuit to activate the alarm. Working The bimetallic strip in a fire alarm is made of two metals with different expansion rates bonded together to form one piece of metal. Typically, the low expansion side is made of a nickel iron alloy called invar, while the high expansion side is an alloy of copper or nickel. The strip is electrically energized with a low voltage current. When the strip is heated by fire, the high expansion side bends the strip to vert the electrical contact. When the strip touches that contact, it completes a circuit that triggers the alarm to sound. The width of the gap between the contacts determines the temperature that will set off the alarm. Demonstration of cubicle expansion in liquids The apparatus consists of a glass tube fitted with a cork having a hole. A narrow glass tube is passed through the hole such that it fits tightly. Water is filled in the bottle to its neck and is colored with potassium permanganate. On heating, one finds that the water begins to rise in the glass tube, showing that liquids undergo cubical expansion on being heated. Thermal Expansion The expansion produced in a matter when heat is supplied to it is called thermal expansion. Linear expansion In this expansion when a solid is heated there is a change in its length alone. Superficial expansion 
In this expansion, when a solid is heated, there is a change in its surface area alone. Cubicle expansion In this expansion, when a solid is heated, there is a change in its volume.